Jean-Pierre de Grailly, also known as Jean de Grailly, died the 7th of September 1376. He was Capital de Bouche, Knight of the Garter, was a Gascon nobleman and a military leader in the Hundred Years' War, who was praised by the chronicler Jean Froissart as an ideal of chivalry. He was the son of Jean de de Grailly, Capital de Bouche, Vicomte de Benoge, and of Blanc de Foix, a cousin of the Counts of Foix. Attached to the English side in the conflict, he was made Count of Bigorre by Edward III of England and was also a founder and the fourth Knight of the Garter in 1348. He played a decisive role as a cavalry leader under Edward, the Black Prince, in the Battle of Poitiers of 1356, with de Bouch leading a flanking move against the French that resulted in the capture of the King of France, John II, as well as many of his nobles. John was taken to London by the Black Prince and held for ransom. In 1364, he commanded the forces of Charles II of Navarre in Normandy, where he was defeated and captured by Bertrand de Gisclin at Cocherel. After his release the following year, he defected to the French side and was made Lord of Nemours by Charles V of France. However, he soon re-established his loyalty to the English and in 1367 he went to Spain with the Black Prince fighting at the Battle of Najera. Here he again faced Bertrand de Gisclin, but this time it was de Gisclin who was captured and the capital was put in charge of the prisoner. He was awarded for his service by being made Constable of Aquitaine in 1371. Again fighting for the English, he commanded an English relief force when the French attacked La Rochelle in 1372. While attempting to lift the siege of Soubise, his force was surprised by a French force led by Owen Logoch, a Welsh soldier of fortune in the French service. The capital and Sir Thomas Percy, Seneschal of Pitou, were captured. The capital spent the remainder of his life as a prisoner at the temple in Paris because Charles V believed him too dangerous to ransom back to the English. Froissart gives an account of the capital de Bouche's chivalry and courage at the time of the peasant uprising in 1358, called the Jacquerie. Jean de Grailly was a prisoner of the French from 1372 onwards. He had refused his freedom as it would have meant taking up arms against the King of England, which he swore to never do. His personal allegiance to the Black Prince was so strong that upon hearing of the Prince's death, he lost all resolve, refused food, and died a few days later in Paris. <laughs> 